Well, I got myself a piece of timber to uh, sort out the problem I created a few days ago in the kitchen with the shells I was I was making. Um, I don't know whether the mugs were up the last time I filmed. I don't think they were. So I got this rail that matches the shelves the glasses are on. So now I have somewhere to hang my mugs, which is nice. And I just need to find a picture then to go to the side of the glasses there to take the bareness out of the wall. Um, still undecided about what to put in the windows here. I had a price back for the blinds that I chose, and which was quite expensive. So I'm on the fence about it. I'll probably go for them, but uh, I just need to jig things around a bit first. Um, but anyway, here is the new piece of timber on the top of the shelves, which now works quite well. Uh, sticks out a little bit from the cabinet next to it, but I don't mind that. It just makes it more usable. And it's got my scales on that we use for baking. And I've just put the plants there for now. I don't know if they'll actually remain there, but they look quite happy. And no doubt we will very soon find things to put on the shelves underneath. It doesn't take long to uh, <laughs> to find things to fill spaces. And my shopping basket sits down there quite nicely. And I wanted to show you what I got for the cubby bed when I was in Ikea the last time. I found curtains, these long curtains here. Now they're not the right length. I need to I need to shorten them. So at the moment they're just folded over the pole. But they're really nice um, off-white textured cotton, which was just what I was looking for. But I couldn't find it to buy by the metre or the yard in a fabric shop. Uh, but there it was in Ikea in ready-made curtains, so um, I'm quite quite pleased with that. So you can pull it across now and be sort of private in the bed if you want to be. And next time I'm with my sewing machine, I will I will change them so that they fit properly. And I also got this, um, it's technically a throw that came from Ikea, but it's more like a scarf really to cover the window here. And it's very nice. It's it's uh, a nice beige and cream colour. It's half and half. And I'm undecided about whether I will cut it in half and make it into two curtains or just leave it as it is and just pull it, pull it to one side. But it's doubled over so it's quite thick and nice. Um, the only thing I don't like about it is, is that it's synthetic. It, it doesn't look it, it looks like cotton, but it, it actually isn't. It's it's um, polyester, I think, which means it was really cheap, but I do prefer cotton things. However, in this instance, I'm not going to complain too much because it's the right colours and it's the right look. And I have another one for the window behind me here, which I will do the same thing with. So, progress is being made.